Giris, my old friend. It's been eons. It's good to see you. Likewise, Lord Liu Kang. I have watched you with the hourglass. You are relishing your role as Earthrealm's protector. It suits me far better than being Keeper of Time ever did. I never wanted to replace Kronika. Being history's architect drove her mad. I had no wish to share her fate. Which is why I am forever grateful that you volunteered to safeguard the Hourglass. Despite my having relinquished its power, the new era has unfolded as it should. You created me in your own image. Duty is my highest calling. While I am glad you are here, you are not one for social calls. Is there trouble with the Hourglass? With something it has shown me. What, Geras? When you restarted history, you altered the destinies of certain malefactors to neutralize them. At least one of them is defying that destiny. Shang Tsung. Go on. He has escaped his meaningless life and is on his way to becoming a powerful sorcerer. He has already infiltrated Sindel's court. I saw no sign of him during the tournament. But if that snake is in Sindel's ear... Your vision of peace may already be compromised. I appreciate this warning, Giris. I will investigate. Please return to the Hourglass and see what else you can learn. So we find him in Outworld and bring him here for questioning? Yes. If what I fear has happened, he is a grave threat to the realms. Anything else? Shang Tsung is a master of deceit. Do not trust a word he utters. Sounds a lot like my first agent. It's a tricky mission. I'd rather Raiden go along than this one. Hey! This one is up for the job. This mission must be done quietly. I am breaking my word with Empress Sindel by sending you into Outworld without her knowledge. Due to the tournament, Raiden is now a familiar face there. Sending him will only increase your risk of being discovered. This talisman is attuned to Shang Tsung's Qi. Follow it to him. And be careful. May the Elder Gods protect you. Are we there yet? Again? How old are you, five? What can I say? These boots weren't made for walking. If that is the most pain you feel today, consider yourself lucky. Oh, I'm already lucky. I've got Sento strapped to my back. I will reclaim it, Cage. Got three million? It's yours. You know I don't have it. I bet you Yakuza pals could come up with it. Oh, that's right. You blew him off. Ah, if there's one lesson Hollywood's taught me, it's never burn bridges. You never know who can help. The Yakuza are leeches, bleeding out those too weak to resist. I grew up in that life, and I never understood it. Why my gain required others' pain. I got out. I need my clan out, too. We can't be part of their crimes any longer. What's your precious say? That Shang Tsung is among those... things. Oh, my fans are gonna go nuts cosplaying them a cage gone. Oh! 
hold him still. If he squirms, I cannot extract marrow. That's Shang Tsung. Let's jump him after he's done. Oh, in fists of iron? We did this thing where, like, we... are not basing strategy on your movies, Cage. Let me go! You can't do this! The wound will heal in time. It is a small price to pay for progress. This scene's playing fine without us. <gasps> yeah, I say we let him finish it. We have to save Shang Tsung. Liu Kang needs him alive. you'd want to, but you can't. You're one of his minions. You'll die in his place. Fight. this looks like, but we don't work for Shang Tsung. If not, why save him? Because Liu Kang, Earthrealm's protector, wants to question him. He thinks Shang Tsung may be a threat to both our realms. I'm Kenshi Takahashi. <laughs> our kind do not shake hands. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to offend. Don't you know what we are? No. We don't. We are victims of Tarkat. The disease is not easily gotten, but you can't risk more close exposure. It disfigures, then debilitates. In time, it will turn us all into bloodthirsty monsters. Death is our only release. So you weren't always like this? I was once a rich merchant, but when I became ill, I was banished. Now I run this colony. I am Baraka. What does Shang Tsung want with your bone marrow, Baraka? I don't know, but he comes here each month to harvest it. Release us, and we'll capture Shang Tsung. And we'll find out why he's been coming here. I promise. Let them go. Thank you. We won't let you down. Damn. This was guiding us to Shang Tsung. Now we can't find him. His laboratory is near. I'll take you. Any idea what to expect? No. 
I've never been inside. Stay here. We'll check it out. The addition of crushed chitin larva proved an inspired choice. In testing, outcomes improved significantly. I have modified the formula since the last time it was administered. It uses several new ingredients. This new serum is exactly what we need. Its effects will be immediate and long-lasting. How can you be sure? Because it is brewed from freshly extracted Tarkatan marrow. It couldn't be more potent. He is infecting Melina with Tarkat. And he's got two of Sindel's top dogs in on it. No wonder Liu Kang is worried about this guy. We need to stop him. Save a distressed damsel? <laughs> sure thing. Get away from her, you bitch. Excuse me? You know, the movie. Tiny girl, ginormous alien. Ready? No? Seriously? <laughs> Earthrealmers. How did they find it? They've already seen too much. I need time. Buy it for me. Liu Kang sent you, didn't he? Sent you to learn our secrets. He sent us here for Shang Tsung, but it looks like he's just part of the problem. Fight! <laughs> is brought low. I thought Umgadi were loyal to the royal house. Yet here you are, scheming against the princess. You trespass in Outworld. Interfere in Imperial matters. It is you, not I, who is the schemer here. Fight.
plot is over. Step away from the table. This is twice you've been a thorn in my side. You Earthrealmers do have unhealthy habits. You heard him. You're not infecting her with Tarkat. I am trying to protect her, not infect her. We've heard about how you lie. Excuse us if we're skeptical. Cover him. Princess, are you all right? Uh, is it over? Yes, you're safe. We've stopped Shang Tsung. Stopped him? Why? Princess! Princess, what's wrong? What did you do to her? It's what you've done, fool. Let me help her before it's too late. Time to finish more serum. Johnny, a hand? We got pages for this? Or are we winging it? Whatever we do, we can't hurt her. Her? I'm worried about us. <laughs> Princess, we can help you. Your blood. I smell it. How sweet it will be to lick off my fingers. Kong Lao, help hold her down. It's now or never, Shang Tsung. sent to disrupt your sister's treatment and scandalize Outworld by revealing her illness. What? That's totally fake news! Princess, we were... Thank you, Goro. I've no stomach for Earthrealm lies. We should detain the Earthrealmers and the Tarkatan we found outside. At least until the Empress is ready to respond to this incursion. Agreed. But she must realize that this incident proves Earthrealm's bad faith. We must strike them now to protect ourselves. No. No, they would not do this. There must be a misunderstanding. It is 
No misunderstanding, princess. It is a confirmation of my prophecy. Left unchecked, Liu Kang will conquer Outworld. I apologize for not arriving sooner to defend your sister. I am glad she received her treatment. The princess is safe, but the threat from Earthrealm remains. Yes. Quan Chi, when do you anticipate they will strike? Soon. Today's events were foretold in the final quatrains of the prophecy. Then I am right. We must act now, Princess. I will take your concerns to the Empress. It is for her to decide. Rain, Tanya, assist me. What truly happened here, sorcerer? That the Earth Realmers interrupted the princess's treatment was happenstance. They were here to capture me for Liu Kang. You? Why? That I must investigate. For now, let us revel in our good fortune. The Earth Realmers' serendipitous arrival has given us ample evidence to convince the Empress of the truth of Quan Chi's prophecy. Conflict with Earthrealm is now inevitable. Not necessarily. The Empress has never been eager for conflict. If she resists, she will be replaced. Outworld needs a steadfast leader. A leader like you, perhaps. If my realm requires it of me, Kill the Earth Realmers. They cannot report back to Liu Kang. Oh, their deaths will also feed the ire between realms. Two birds, one stone. <laughs> Our benefactor will be pleased. She needs the realms at war, not at the brink of it, in order to conquer them both. Only then will we rule at her side. Before she found me languishing in the mines, I would not have thought such a thing possible. But soon, she'll have transformed us from serfs into scions. <laughs> 